This documentary is on Africans' wonder of the world, the Great Zimbabwe Ruins. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. The Great Zimbabwe Ruins, located in the southeastern part of Zimbabwe, are a testament to the rich history and culture of Africa. These ruins, which are estimated to be over 800 years old, are a fascinating example of the architectural and artistic achievements of the ancient African civilization that once inhabited the region. Today, they remain one of the most important historical sites on the continent, attracting visitors from all over the world who are eager to learn more about Africa's glorious past. One of the most popular and enduring legends surrounding the Great Zimbabwe Ruins is that they were once a lost city of gold. The legend of the lost city of gold in Zimbabwe has been captivating people for centuries. According to the legend, the city was once a thriving metropolis, filled with untold riches and treasures, including vast amounts of gold. The inhabitants of the city were said to have hidden away these treasures before they fled the city, and many people have attempted to find them over the years. Despite extensive searches and excavations, however, the lost city of gold has never been found, leaving many to wonder if it ever truly existed. The legend of the lost city of gold in Zimbabwe has its roots in the history of the region. Zimbabwe was once home to a powerful and sophisticated civilization known as the Kingdom of Zimbabwe. This kingdom flourished between the 11th and 15th centuries, and its people were skilled in agriculture, mining, and trade. They built large stone structures, including the famous Great Zimbabwe Ruins, which were a testament to their engineering and architectural prowess. The Kingdom of Zimbabwe was also known for its gold mines. The region was rich in gold deposits, and the kingdom's rulers were able to amass vast amounts of wealth from mining and trade. This wealth allowed them to build impressive structures and establish a powerful and influential civilization. Over time, however, the kingdom began to decline. Various factors, including climate change, political instability, and economic decline, contributed to its downfall. By the 15th century, the kingdom had collapsed and its people had dispersed. It is believed that the legend of the lost city of gold in Zimbabwe arose as a result of the wealth and power of the Kingdom of Zimbabwe. The idea of a city filled with gold and other treasures was too tempting for explorers and adventurers to resist, and many attempted to find the lost city over the years. One of the most famous attempts to find the lost city of gold was made by the Portuguese explorer, João de Barros. In the early 16th century, Barros heard rumors of a city filled with gold in the region and decided to set out in search of it. He traveled through the area for several months, but was unable to find the city. Despite his failure, however, the legend of the lost city of gold persisted, and many others continued to search for it over the centuries. Today, the lost city of gold remains one of the enduring mysteries of Zimbabwe's history. While there is no evidence to suggest that the city ever truly existed, the legend continues to inspire people to search for it. The story of the lost city of gold also serves as a reminder of the rich history and culture of Zimbabwe and the African continent as a whole. In recent years, there has been a renewed interest in the history of Zimbabwe and the Kingdom of Zimbabwe. Archaeologists and historians have been studying the Great Zimbabwe ruins and other sites in the region, in an effort to gain a better understanding of the civilization that once thrived there. These efforts have revealed many new insights into the history of the region and have helped to dispel some of the myths and legends that have surrounded it. Despite the fact that the lost city of gold in Zimbabwe may never be found, the legend of its existence will likely continue to captivate people for years to come. As long as there are tales of lost treasures and ancient civilizations, 
the legend of the lost city of gold will endure as a reminder of the power of myth and the enduring allure of the past. Another title for the Great Zimbabwe Ruins is A Window into Africa's Glorious Past. This title reflects the idea that the ruins offer a unique glimpse into the rich and diverse history of Africa, which has often been overlooked or forgotten in Western narratives. The Great Zimbabwe Ruins are a reminder that Africa has a long and proud history that deserves to be celebrated and studied. They provide an opportunity for visitors to learn more about the achievements of ancient African civilizations and to appreciate the beauty and complexity of their art, architecture, and culture. The Great Zimbabwe Ruins are also known as the Enigma of the Great Zimbabwe, exploring a forgotten civilization. Despite the wealth of archaeological evidence that has been gathered about the site, much about the civilization that built it remains a mystery. Historians and archaeologists are still trying to piece together the story of the great Zimbabwe people, including their origins, their way of life, and the reasons for the decline of their civilization. The ruins offer tantalizing clues and hints about the culture and society of this ancient people, but much about them remains unknown. African Wonder of the World the Great Zimbabwe Ruins is another fitting title for this historic site. The Great Zimbabwe Ruins are a marvel of architecture and engineering, with massive stone walls, intricate carvings, and complex structures that have withstood the test of time. They are a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of the people who built them and a reminder of the impressive achievements of African civilizations throughout history. The ruins are a source of pride and wonder for the people of Zimbabwe and for all Africans who appreciate the rich cultural heritage of the continent. Uncovering the Great Zimbabwe, The Secrets of a Mysterious Kingdom is a title that highlights the ongoing efforts of historians and archaeologists to unravel the mysteries of the Great Zimbabwe ruins. These efforts involve a wide range of research techniques, including archaeological excavation, radiocarbon dating, and historical analysis. Through these methods, researchers hope to gain a better understanding of the people who built the ruins and the society and culture that they lived in. This ongoing work promises to reveal many new insights into the history of Zimbabwe and Africa as a whole. A Journey Through Time the Great Zimbabwe Ruins is a title that captures the sense of wonder and discovery that visitors experience when exploring the site. Walking through the ruins is like taking a journey back in time, to a world that is both familiar and strange. The ruins offer a unique opportunity to experience the history and culture of Africa in a visceral and tangible way. Visitors can see the ruins up close, touch the stones that were laid by ancient hands, and imagine what life must have been like in this distant and exotic place. The Legacy of the Great Zimbabwe, an African Empire Rediscovered is a title that captures the enduring importance of the Great Zimbabwe ruins for the people of Zimbabwe and for all Africans. The ruins are a symbol of the rich cultural heritage of the continent and a reminder of the achievements of ancient African civilizations. They are also a source of inspiration for modern African artists, musicians, and writers, who draw on the imagery and symbolism of the ruins in their work. The legacy of the Great Zimbabwe extends beyond the borders of Zimbabwe and Africa, as the ruins have become a global icon of African history and culture. By rediscovering and celebrating the legacy of the Great Zimbabwe, Africans can gain a greater appreciation for their own cultural heritage and a deeper understanding of their place in the world. In conclusion, the Great Zimbabwe Ruins are a testament to the rich history and cultural heritage of Zimbabwe and Africa as a whole. They are a source of inspiration for modern African artists, musicians, and writers, and a symbol of the achievements of ancient African civilizations. The ruins offer a glimpse into the past, providing us with a window into a glorious African civilization that thrived more than six centuries ago.
Despite the fact that the Great Zimbabwe Ruins have faced many challenges over the years, they remain an important cultural and historical site, and a popular destination for tourists from around the world. Efforts to preserve and protect the ruins have been ongoing, and today they are recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This recognition has helped to raise awareness of the importance of the ruins and to ensure that they will be protected and celebrated for generations to come. Overall, the Great Zimbabwe Ruins serve as a powerful reminder of the rich history and cultural heritage of Africa. They are a testament to the ingenuity, creativity, and resilience of the people who built them, and a source of inspiration for all those who seek to understand the past and to build a better future. By studying and celebrating the legacy of the Great Zimbabwe, we can gain a deeper appreciation for the diversity and richness of African culture, and a greater understanding of our place in the world. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up with our new videos. Thank you.